A A A. <sighs> hello, 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 people. Hello, hello, hello. How are we doing? How are we feeling? We're feeling good. Very, very excited about this this show tonight. We've got the lovely Leanne joining any minute now. Um, look, I'm very like color coordinated right now. Got the whole the bottle, the wall. It's a great vibe. It is a great vibe. But yeah, I'm gonna have a little chat with my girl and just see see what happens. See what happens. You know what I mean? But um, I'm excited. And yeah, I've got no nails on, which is a little bit sad, but gotta do what you gotta do all right let's get her in hi hello <laughs> how are you i'm so good i mean i'm as good as i can be how are you oh, same <laughs> yes i feel like I don't know about you, but I feel like I can't imagine normal life now. Me neither. It's so like, weird, isn't it? So odd. So odd. But we're here. How are you feeling on the whole? In general, you look stunning. Your skin's oh, glowing. I was thinking the exact same about you. You look amazing. Well, I did have... I had um, an interview over Zoom, so I do have a face of makeup on, so I can't really take credit for it, but I appreciate oh, it. Amazing. I love the green as well. Green's I know, I was saying. Look at this. <laughs> Colour coordination. <laughs> but yeah, how are, you, how are you feeling? How have you been? Yeah, I've been good. Um, yeah, it's obviously like we've got a breakup song out. So just been sort of promoting that. But yeah. yeah, really strange to not see the girls and to like be doing everything from home. Yeah, it must be very, very odd. Yeah, I've, I've had like up and down days. But recently, I feel like I've been just trying to enjoy it more. I've been relaxing more. Um... And just actually enjoying not really having to think about a lot. Yeah. Know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Because don't really get those times, so... I think yeah. so I think it's funny, like, obviously at the beginning, I think everyone was panicking and it was like, how are things going to work? And I think people, you know, I, we, I think, like, it was really hard to not try and plan, like, okay, maybe in two weeks we'll be able to do this, or in three weeks. But I yeah. think now it's good to just take each day as it comes and actually 100%. just try and see the positives and, like, you know, we're lucky to be sort of safe and exactly. healthy anyway. So it's just enjoying it. Definitely. Really. But um, yeah, let's talk about Breakup Song. Obviously, it's been out for what? Like, would it be like three weeks or something now? Um, yeah. Oh, my God. Time's gone quick. Yeah. About quick. That. Yeah. I, yeah, I love this song. I absolutely love it. It yeah. is a bop. <laughs> no, no, no. Like, honestly, and I'm not, not just saying it like I literally play it all the time like Aww. all the time it's one of my favorite songs of yours and i just think i just love i love like a kind of a bop with like a like a sad bop like you just gotta love a sad bop yeah exactly because like you can't like go wrong lyrics. yeah it's, it's a breakup song but it really do, it doesn't make you feel like that it makes you feel no. happy and like you're like i don't need him i'm gonna go out I don't yes know. it's so weird because i don't when i listen to it i don't even think about the message i just just get that uplifted feeling so yeah. yeah I think well so do I it makes me feel very ready to go ready to go yeah, yeah. and I want to talk about um we're a bit late now but um it was in a seashell's first birthday so congrats to your baby oh, for turning one thank you. what um what kind of inspired you to do that because you obviously must have felt very passionate you're a very busy lady so then to have a whole okay. kind of like other business which is like yours must be quite a lot but what kind of made you think like oh I want to do that well I've always always loved swimwear um I love fashion in general like the dream is to have a fashion line but I've always always loved swimwear um and I actually found a post I did I had a little blog called Lee Loves years ago and I found a post on that well a fan posted it um and it was basically me saying my dream was to have my own swimwear brand and i absolutely love bikinis like, that is so crazy yeah and like fast forward however many years and i'm here now with my own brand like yeah it's crazy Look but i love it. doing it yeah i love having something on my own like yeah of course grow no i mean it must be amazing to like see something and you're just like 
that is mine like without me like this would not be here and that's such a nice like full circle moment to look yeah. back on you know that that post that you said and you're like wow I, I did it it's you're out here it. achieving your goals living your dreams Aww, stunning yeah. I need to I need, honestly I need I need to order one because I'm the same like I love I love swimwear like I love mm -hmm. it especially like I think because before it got like took me a while to even think that I could wear like bikinis like that but now I'm at a point where I'm like fuck it I don't care like I look Mate, great yes. in whatever yeah I'm gonna stock up I love those like high-rise bikini bombs like okay I'm gonna be sending you some bikinis your way very soon oh my god <laughs> I'm, I'm about to spend my coin I'm here to, to support the cause I'm here to support no, the cause. Mate, I'm awesome. <laughs> I mean when we can be on a beach again who knows but do you have we garden? can we can plan. Do you have a garden? I do. I do have a garden, so yeah. I can sunbathe in the garden. The only thing is, I mean, this is like such a first world problem. Like, it's not really a problem, but <laughs> I, I have a really great garden here. But because of like the way at the side of the street we're on, after like twelve or one o'clock, it doesn't really get much sun. Ah, oh, right. I know. I know. And I feel really bad complaining about it, but yeah. I'm, like, <laughs> I'm like, damn it. And oh, I would be like. Yeah. My sleeping pattern is so messed up, so I don't actually get out. I, like, I find it really hard to get out of bed, like, before 11.30. So by the time I get out, I'm like, I've already nearly gone, so. Right, okay. Me too, by the way. I'm getting up so late nowadays. So bad, isn't it? Oh, yeah. I really don't like it. Like, I I'm the sort of person I like to have. I'm not, like, an early bird, like, 6 a.m., but I would like to get out of bed at, like, half nine. But I'm just like, yeah. it ain't working. Imagine when we, have, when we actually do go back to work and we're going to be waking up at 7 a.m every morning no. 7 a.m that's no that's not right <laughs> that's right. like going back to school i can't do that uh, i have to do yeah. like shoot this i have like a thing that i need to shoot on friday mm -hmm. and they were like yeah can you start shooting at 10 30 and obviously it's not that early but in my head i'm like oh, no my God. Yeah. <laughs> the idea of doing something at 10 30 in the morning i'm like how am i gonna do this uh, but you know what i don't mind as much because i literally just roll out of bed and then just do what i need to do and I think it'll it'll force me <laughs> to get out of bed. Like that's what I need. I need like someone to be like, you need to get up right now, otherwise I'll just sleep. Who are you quarantining with? Who are you? I am with my. I'm at my dad's house. I'm not in London right now. I'm in Cornwall. We came down like two months <gasps> You're ago. You're in Cornwall. Oh my gosh! Wow. I know. I know. I'm oh, literally, God. literally like a ten minute walk from the beach. Oh my god. I so wow. so I'm so lucky. Like literally today, I had I didn't have the best day today just earlier on because I was just, you know when you wake up and you're just like oh, it's not a good day it's not a good day um yeah. so I literally just walked down to the beach and I just sat there and I just like looked at the sea for a bit and I was like I'm so lucky to just have that oh that's amazing but, yeah so that's really nice so I'm with my, my dad um my three brothers and my stepmom and I don't get to see my little brothers that often because they live down here okay. so oh that's lovely then okay what are, what are the names of your dogs because i literally like need them in my life my babies well it's actually really sad so i've got harvey and cairo mm. harvey's the little pug and cairo is the big beast i call oh, him cairo oh. yeah he's just he's a dream isn't he no 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 honestly i literally watch your stories and i'm like that looks like a good time god i love him but he's just had an operation <laughs> yeah. is he all right is he gonna yeah he's good he um he tore his um, cruciate ligament, his back leg, when he was running. See, I don't even know what that is, but that right. sounds painful. <sighs> Honestly, it's just, it's a nightmare, because now he's got to have 12 weeks of, like, full rest. Oh and we God. can actually take him for 10-minute walks on a lead. He's got to be on a lead in the garden. Like, oh it's just, Lord. yeah, I just feel awful Poor for Cairo. Him. I'm praying for Cairo. I'm thinking of I know. Cairo. And he's got this shaved leg. It just looks like a bit of ham. Cause, like, oh, no. <laughs> Bless him. He's just going too. He's going too crazy in the garden. He's just been like, he needs to chill. I know. That story. What was it? I think it was your um, pug and like his, that his little face was like stuck oh, behind the sofa. So many rolls. Like, oh my <laughs> Honestly, I've been trying to like. So two of my my best friends, Zara, who you would have met, my makeup artist, who was on yeah. tour with me. So Zara and like one of my other best friends, Hanya, they've both decided they're getting dogs like in fucking quarantine so my uh -huh. Hanya she's getting a little sausage dog in like a week 
Yeah. And Zara's getting an Italian Greyhound and I've ordered them. I'm going to be like a like their like doggy arm and I've ordered oh. them little doggy hats. I'm like really enjoying it. Stop it. Because I really want a dog, but I'm like, I probably can't look after one. Like, I can barely look after right. myself. So I'm just going to look after theirs for Fair a little enough. bit and see how it goes. Oh, I love dash hounds. The look, is it, are they the, the little ones, right? The little sausage dogs. Mm, so yeah. I know. And she's calling it Mango. Oh, stop it. I know. I if know, you, honestly. If you could have any dog, what would you want? What breed? My favourite dog, I mean, I, I love dogs. I used to have a Labrador, like a chocolate lab. So I, I have like a special place in my heart for chocolate labs. But I really like corgis and nobody else seems to like, whenever I say, oh, I love corgis, everyone's like... Why would you get a corgi? But I'm like, they're so cute. What's a corgi again? Corgi, they're like, I think I think the reason why people are a bit like that about it is because the the queen has them. You know those ones, and they're really, really, they're like long but really fluffy, and they have like mini legs, and they kind of like plod around. Oh, okay. After this, look up corgis, like yeah, corgi I will, puppies. I will. They are the cutest little things Aww. in the world. But um, I was wondering, like, what. I see that you obviously enjoy a little bit of cooking in the kitchen, yes. which I could have a few tips because honestly I have no idea what I'm doing. But I was wondering, like, what is your go-to, like, comfort food, like, feel good, like, oh, I just want to, I just want to, you know, have a little, but, like, an indulge, like, indulging yourself. Like, what's your go-to? Well, I love pizza. Um... Yeah. And I love cheese. Oh, yes. Cheese. So, my favourite thing to eat really is nachos. Um, I saw you made some of those, didn't you? Yeah. Like, I am the nacho queen. I love them. <laughs> nacho <laughs> queen! <laughs> um, so, yeah, I feel like a plate of nachos with all the trimmings. I'm actually making it on Friday. Yeah. <gasps> what are you doing on, like, on Instagram or something? Are you going to film no, this? just for myself. I'll just for yourself? Myself. Yeah, <laughs> but um, yeah, I love nachos. You can't go wrong. You can't go wrong. It's like every delicious thing, like on one plate. Oh, right, and the, just the combination of it all together. Oh. I feel like anything that I can eat with my hands, I'm like, I'm down for it. Yeah, that's so true. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. I feel like if I'm eating it with my hands, I'm like, I'm thoroughly enjoying it. Yes, getting in there. Yeah, getting in there. What about you? Like, um. About? I mean, I'm not like the best cook. Uh, I've been kind of lazy in quarantine because obviously I'm, I'm obviously now I'm living with my dad. It's like, yeah, I just I'm like, wow, this is great because I feel like <laughs> I've not I've not had to cook that much. I mean, I, I like to make like pasta and like nice pasta mm -hmm. sauces, and I've not done it in quarantine. But I think my go-to thing, which is really easy and quite delicious, is like salmon. I love to cook salmon because I feel like it's really easy to like. It's really easy for it for you to make it taste good. Yeah, if that makes sense. I'm gonna give you a little tip, but you might do it already. So um, drizzle some honey on it. I've done that before. I've, that actually, I've actually done that before. Honey and a little bit of soy. Yes, yeah. I like the kind of aromatic, mm. kind of like more like Asian vibes. Like yeah, soy sauce, yeah. honey, garlic, chili, coriander. <laughs> but that's literally the only thing I know how to make, and the rest I'm just like, oh no. <laughs> do you know what though? I feel like it's just practice. It is, and that's, this is the perfect time to practice, but I've not really been doing it, but I think I will. I'm going to force myself. Yeah. Have you been like, I've been trying to force myself to work out, but that's also not been working for me. Uh, do you know what? I'm not going to lie. I've literally worked out every day. I'm so jealous of your me. willpower. I don't <laughs> get it. Like, I would literally say to my boyfriend all the time, yep, yeah, going to go gym today. Or if I would go on holiday, I'd be like, I'm going to gym it every day. And he'd be like, no, you're not. And I'll be like, stop being so rude. But now I'm- <laughs> Yes, I am. <laughs> yes, every day. Like, yeah. I'm, oh, really I'm proud. You're going to come out of here like snatched. Oh, bloody hell. I just want to be toned. Like, I just want to, yeah, just, that's it. Just like a bit of, yeah. bit of muscle, you know? That's the dream. It's like great. Yes, <laughs> build on what you already have, you know? Yeah. I, yeah, <laughs> I kind of, ha there's, um, there's a, like, per a trainer on Instagram. You might have, heard her her name's Kira London but oh, she know. she does like she does these Instagram workouts she does them on Instagram live every day at like oh. 12 and they are so 
good like literally really? you'll literally be dying but her figure and everything like she proper works on like your legs and your bum like everything oh. but she is a beast like she will work you to the death but you know that she's like doing a good job so you should look her up she's quite she's good and she like plays like really good tunes while she does okay. it um so she's I, she's definitely a good person if you need if you ever need like a little pick me up right okay I'll have you know it's I'll very have good. A Luke. sorry i said i'd have a look at have a look have a look <laughs> and um so i saw the obviously the breakup song video came out recently as well yes and i think to do a video like that obviously in isolation was just so amazing because obviously you have to like work with what you got and I think what you got was so great oh, thank and I you. think it's different and fun but I was just wondering for you like was did you have any kind of anxieties or you know how did you feel about releasing like visuals without mm. being able to do like especially because you know usually you're with the girls and you get to do a whole like thing like how did you feel about that even I though what you got was I... great like how how was it yeah i don't sorry can i just get a charger because if i die on you oh wait go go get a charger it's literally right here wait there no worries no worries it's better than i i've literally done the same thing i've like got my charger plugged in and it's sort of like leaning this way because i'm still on red uh, my phone is never charged and i don't know why oh, i was like no <laughs> back oh. Oh, here we are. <laughs> <laughs> going wrong. Um, okay, let's see if this balances. Oh, God. How do you balance yours if yours? I've got a tripod, babes. Oh, right. That's probably going to There fall. you go, look. Um, yeah, so breakup song. Um, video. Yeah, I, I'm not going to lie. I didn't think it was going to be as good as it was. Just because I'm like, how how is it gonna work? Like, we're not together. Like, I just didn't really know what, how, what to expect from it. Yeah, so of course. We're not used to this, do you know what I mean? Um, yeah. But I was pleasantly surprised that when it all came together and like with the felt and everything, and I feel like the fans just kind of loved that we, we made, still made the effort to do something, do you know what I mean? So, yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, but yeah, I love it, I love it. I saw like, all the tweets, they were like, the girls are keeping us fed during quarantine uh. <laughs> with the content so yeah. yeah i just thought it was just it's just so it's just so mad how it kind of makes you realize like just like that like everything can change but i think it's good because now yeah. you know that if this was to ever happen again for some reason you guys know you know it's not ideal but yeah. it can work and you know Definitely. you're capable of like holding it together yeah i feel like it's such a good time for this song to come out as well like it's of course, like I think it, one of those songs that just makes you feel happy and like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope fully that's what you're doing with it. It's a so. perfect quarantine song, and can I just say, oh my lord, that what was it? Was it was it for the BBC that kind of the um performance that you that you girls did together? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, uh, the stay at home. The yes, yes, stay at home like festival. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. No, no, no. That I was literally shook. Sure like mm -hmm. honestly like all of you were just amazing but what I, I i fucking i put it on my story that high note i was like whoa oh, thank you no 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 i fucking love that that was chef's kiss oh honestly i was really really working myself up when i was trying to record it <laughs> no 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 well it paid off it, i haven't sung it in so long and like that note is it either comes really naturally or it's a bit alien because I haven't done it in a while. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, of course. So I was just, yeah, I was stressing myself out, but I got there in the end. <laughs> yeah, honestly, I watched that and I was like, Jesus. Oh, Damn. thank you. No, no, it was amazing. It was amazing. I'm going to see, I won't keep you for too much longer, but I just thought that we've got like loads of questions here. So I thought we could oh. just you know, I just see. realise my, my wig is like in the back and it's really embarrassing. <laughs> I didn't even remember it. <laughs> I'm gonna move it out of the way. Oh my god. <laughs> no, Stan, we love. Oh god. This is great. Oh, how was um I saw obviously um a while ago you went to Brazil, was it? It was Brazil. And yes. I saw obviously I think there was like a clip and it kind of went viral of you. You were like it was really like nice to watch, but you were getting quite like overwhelmed, obviously yeah. when you, like, saw the fans there. How 
<sighs> well, obviously, how was that? Like, what was that feeling? What kind of made, what kind of got that reaction out of you? Um, well, one, like, the fan base. I, we've been waiting to go to Brazil for so long. And yeah. getting there and actually feeling like Justin Bieber was crazy. Um, <laughs> and just, like, so overwhelming. Yeah. Um, yeah. It was just, it was something that the fans said to me. And it was just, like... It just made me feel just, this is why I'm doing what I'm doing. And mm. this is why I'm speaking out on things and yeah. And like saying how I feel about things and hoping that it's, and knowing that it's helping people is just like amazing. Yeah. No, you could really yeah. tell. I was just like, honestly, I watched it and I was like, I'm getting a bit emotional here. Aww. It was just so nice because it was such a candid moment. And yeah, it was just yeah. like, I'm so happy that that person caught that because you could really see how, like, how much that moment meant to you. And I was oh, like, wow, goals. Yeah. That is goals. <laughs> um, cool. Well, I'm going to let you go on and enjoy your evening because I don't want to keep you too long and it's getting a bit late. But thank you oh. so much for joining me. I've had such a good time. It's been lovely. Thank you. Yeah, and hopefully no we can, yeah, do something when this is all over. I and... know. Honestly... I'm, I'm like gagging for somebody else to serve me an alcoholic beverage. Like I'm sick. <laughs> I'm sick of serving it to myself. I want to go to a oh. bar and have someone make me a cocktail. <laughs> yeah. Let's go out. Let's have some fun. I'm, fun. I'm ready. Whenever you're ready, babes. Ah, thank you for having me. No worries. Thank you for coming on. Enjoy your evening. And I hope Cairo feels better soon. Thank you, babe. Mwah. Take care Bye. of yourself. Bye. 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 You too. Bye. 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 <laughs> Ooh, ooh, ooh. what a stunner we stan we stan um cool that was really fun thank you guys um